Hello guys, how are you doing? So, I'm going to watch episode 558 of One Piece today and it was once again really awesome to see the new things that the Straw Hat Pirates are able to do now after what they learned during those uh, two years um, but now something uh, bad is happening so um, that ship that um, Vanderdecken threw um, in the direction of uh, Shira Oshi um, is now uh, actually emerging so that's uh, not looking good and hopefully uh, these guys will find a way to prevent uh, something worse from happening and uh, of course um, that implies preventing that ship from crashing uh, into that place. Um, but yeah, I really can't wait to um, to see what's going to happen and uh, uh, like there's this thing about uh, Ordi Jones and how um, Luffy is um, like so far he's been able to eat him um, quite easily. I mean, he's, um, of course Luffy is quite strong and uh, with the second gear he can become uh, really fast. Um, but uh, Ordi Jones is, um, it's like he's not prepared uh, for um, for those attacks. So I don't know if it's, um, if he's just like too surprised, like not expecting Luffy um, to be that fast. Um, but yeah, I'm not expecting him to keep um, being uh, beaten up uh, like this over and over again. I mean, at some point, um, he's probably going to do something, um, something more. Um, so yeah, this is um, most likely far from over and really can't wait um, to see what's going to happen during these uh, next moments. So with this, hope you guys are ready and let's start this episode. It's really impressive to see everything they can do now. And this thing about um, Surume, he actually has a brother. He's being threatened by Ordi Jones. But I love this because he's um This became a bit more personal to Luffy because of his own brother and what he had to deal with before. So now it's like he wants to do this for for Surume to help him save his brother, just like how Jimbei and the others try to help Luffy. Saving his brother Ace. Even though... In the end it wasn't possible, so that was... The sad part about it. Hopefully the outcome of this one will be different. Yeah, that implies defeating Ordi Jones. About this though... I mean, just look at the size of that thing. It's really dangerous. It's going to break. Oh, so it's happening like that. It's nice to see this view too, because it's so big. It's hard to... to see what's actually happening if they zoom in too much. Yeah, that looks pretty bad. Yeah. There was a purpose for that ship as well. Even though that's the least of their problems now because it's about to crash on them. We need to find a way to prevent that.
It is. Hmm. Not with not with him around. <laughs> Man, that's so nice. <laughs> Now he's going to blush. <laughs> that was to be expected. Oh, damn! And now it comes back and adbutts him. Hmm. Oh, he's doing it. Oh, just a small part. Sure. <laughs> Bell. <laughs> Even the face was printed there. <laughs> yep. It's amazing how we can do that now with Aki. Oh damn, his leg! <laughs> there was those guys. He's owning this guy. I wonder, can Ordi Jones actually do something about Luffy? Like against him? I was expecting a really epic fight, but it's so one-sided. Yeah, the observation Aki. Exactly. Can just... Dance through those. Not true, but you guys know what I mean. Another one. And this is crazy. And I love how he when he uses the hardening Aki. I don't think it's the hardening Aki, but. Like when he uses, I think it's the armament Aki to harden his body parts. I love how he turns black to show that, to represent that it's like different, like hardened. Back to the ship. I still want to learn about the story of this ship. What was the purpose? Was it supposed to be an arc, but I don't know for what. Maybe the day when they would all go to the... to land. Like everyone would get in, in that ship and get out of here. Not too sure. Tension. Damn, it's tilting. This is what I was wondering about before. It was like going to emerge and then tilt and then point at them. Then go in their, their direction. Oh, that's also a good point. The bubble is preventing the water from entering. 
So if it even breaks that, it's really bad for this place. Holy... I have no idea, like, what they can do about that. Maybe Robin, with the... Oh my god, really? That's what she thinks about. I can say it's a surprise, but... I was wondering if maybe she could... Use her power to... Push it backwards or something? I don't know if she would be... Strong enough for that, because of the size of it. Oh, it's that guy. Holy... <laughs> oh my god. Okay then. So he's actually on the ship. I was wondering if he stayed down there or if he came as well. Artie Jones is not out, but. Not doing well. Yeah, those drugs. Well, it's part of his. Oh, he's there. So small. I mean... Like, really tiny compared to the size of the ship. And this guy... Yeah, sure, accept my love, just... Throws a ship over Earth to kill everyone, like... His logic... And that makes me remember what Robin just said. Oh my god, that's... She can be really... I don't know how to say it, like, dark sometimes. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, sure. Love, he says. Or like interest. Damn. What can they do against this? Ooh, the chain... He yeah, doesn't care about anyone, just his own... On ideals. Maybe the... Maybe Surome could do something as well. Shirawashi, is she doing something? Uh... 
What is she up to? Wait, it goes after Shirawashi, so maybe she's... Damn it, she's trying to make him stop, like ac accepting his... his terms. To save all of them. Or is she like going to... She gets it. Maybe she can fool him a bit. Damn, that's so admirable of her. How brave. I was actually thinking that maybe she would go outside of that bubble and the ship would go after her and that way it wouldn't destroy this, uh, this place. It's happening, it's changing. So that's still happening. Damn. You know, it's kind of over between them. But yeah, she's doing good. Like something around those lines, like what I was thinking about. Luring it away from there. Yeah, hopefully nothing bad will happen to her. Sure. It actually eat her! Man, I hate this guy so much. It was on her arm. Man. I mean, I have a lot of mixed feelings about this. It's really brave of Shirawashi to do this. But she's uh, still in danger, so...
Oh, damn. Oh, Sanji. Yeah, they need to get rid of this guy. Yeah, that's a problem. Yeah, he has that thingy around him, so... He's going to fight with that. Oh, damn! <laughs> My beloved. Damn, that's nice. I mean... This was... Um... Like, this, this was something that was not crossing my mind before, like, when I was uh, wondering about uh, how the ship would crash into this site. I mean, I was expecting, uh, not expecting, but was hoping for it uh, um, to not eat the place. Uh, but I wasn't thinking about the bubble and how it um, protects this place from being flooded. So that was, um, of course, uh, a big problem. And, um, I mean, as I said before, this gave me a lot of mixed feelings because... I loved to see Shirawashi doing this, like, she was really brave and, uh, like, uh, trying to, um, to make that ship not crash into that place, like, go after her and that way not, um, not crash um, in that place. Um, so, yeah, like, that's uh, good, of course, because it will uh, save all of these uh, people, um, but they still need to do something about Van der Decken, because that ship is still going um, after Shiraoshi and will only stop, uh, just like he mentioned, um, when it hits uh, the target or something else. So... They really need to do, to do something about this for uh, everyone's sake, because, uh, like, Van der Decken is a big trash and he really needs to be stopped. Um, but, yeah, again, I really I really love Shirawashi. I mean, it's impossible to uh, do not uh, like um, her personality and, uh, like, literally everything she does, and especially considering everything she um, is going through, and, like, for a really long time already... Um, so yeah, it's once again really impressive to the, uh, to see her doing uh, something like this. Um, and yeah, she needs um, she still needs some help. Hopefully, they will be able to uh, at least stop Vanderdecken for now and then deal with um, Ordi Jones um, uh, afterwards. Um, but there's still this thing. So at some point, it felt like Ordi Jones was um, maybe going uh, against Vanderdecken because of what he tried to do. Um, but now it's um, it's not looking like that uh, anymore because he was uh, saying that uh, like it was um, like um, I don't know how exactly he said it, but he didn't uh, like um, the way uh, Van der Decken was acting. Uh, but uh, he also said that he liked uh, the idea. So it's uh, like of course like it's it's um, something that will make um, Ori Jones not exactly go against Van der Decken. Um, but yeah, really can't wait to see what else is going to happen. And just like I said uh, um, before, I hope that um, I like. I'm sure that at some point they're going to do this, but I just hope that they show it as uh, as, um, as soon as possible. Um, like the story of um, that ship, because it's um, it's not uh, very clear. Like the only thing I know is that uh, it's supposed to be an arc, and like I know, but usually an arc is uh, like supposed to exist in order to save people right so i don't know if the whole idea was for um like maybe the moment when um the the fishman um went to, to like uh, like above the sea like to like to other places maybe they would use this place or like this ship to uh for everyone to evacuate or something but i mean at the same time that would imply that something bad um would happen to the fishman island right so i'm not too sure like it's something that i can only make a theories about i will need to see um the full explanation uh, later on um, but yeah, it's definitely something that um, made me curious and hopefully they will um, show it uh, uh, again as soon as possible. 
Um, and yeah, right now just really can't wait to see what's going to happen during this next episode. So, with this, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.